morning everyone today is Wednesday September 21st 2022 where is it that way we all say public book now <laughs> uh, it's nine o'clock we slept in a little bit today because we can we only have eight miles less than eight miles to go to our next destination which is the village of Grasmere I love Grasmere I already booked uh, a private room at a youth hostel, just like that one. But we have a private room tonight. Uh, and the, today, hike difficulty, one mile of flat through the village of Rosswaite, beautiful village of Rosswaite. And then um, about three and a half miles of climb. Uh, not as hard as yesterday. Yesterday was very hard. We are all sore. <laughs> Four months ago, I took the high route through all the crags, but this time we're gonna take the valley route. A total of 7.8 miles to our next hostel. I forgot which way. <laughs> I believe it's this way. Yeah, but what kind of footpath? There's so many footpaths. You have to check map. Pretty little cottages. The beautiful village of Rotsway. I want to live here, but there's nothing to do but hike. <laughs> yeah, hike the coast to coast all the time. <laughs> Is that chicken coop or what? That's so weird. This part of this all that stone and it just turned into stucco. <laughs> We go in this way. And then, yeah. strangely, there's a pu public toilet over there. Okay. <laughs> Aww. And one cow. Black how, kiln how. What is how? What There's does that mean? Cottage how back there. <laughs> Look at this public restroom right in the middle of the village. Going towards Stone Weight. I can't pronounce it. Stone Weight. So happy. I did this part of the hike back in May on the second day. <laughs> on the second day, I did 19 miles, almost 20 miles, and it broke me. I had to take a recovery day on day three. <laughs> so now I know better to break it up. Especially because we did the high route, so there's no way we could hike anymore. The high route yesterday was tough. It was so worth it though, but it was hard work. You have to be prepared for it. The ascent toward Green Up Edge has started. Gradual right now. Mm. 
Wow, it's so beautiful. We're 2.7 miles in. And climb. Fair climber. Hi, Benderium. Hi. Mm -hmm. That's what we're climbing to. Uh, that crag right there. It's called Lining Crag. <laughs> when I did it in May, I did this in the at the end of the day. Like I started at 3 p.m. <laughs> after hiking 11 miles or 12 miles. Woo! I underestimated the terrain. Definitely. This time I know better. I broke it down in two days, so it's more enjoyable. <sighs> Plus, I accidentally went on the high route <laughs> over Helm Crags and all the other crags, Calf Crags. <sighs> okay, I think that top of the Lightning Crag is in one mile, maybe one and a half. Beautiful! sheep laying around over there that's Borrowdale Valley that we stayed at last night at the youth hostel oh. Oh, so steep Crag. Oh, almost there. We're about 0.6 more to the top, and our calves are about to burst. <laughs> it feels like it. the crack right there there we go here's the climb the rock scramble with water running through it See water. <laughs> you go this way yep. Okay. Yeah, use your quad.
there's a cairn there. Follow the cairn. I'm flogging. Mining crag. You can do it, Benderam. You can do it. Just run. The faster you go, the faster you finish. Use your quads. Where are you from? In Mexico. Yeah. Okay, not not far from me. <laughs> from you're from Dallas. Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I grew up in San Francisco. Is that a melanzana? Uh huh. Oh, you went to Leadville. Yeah. Yeah. Windy. Uh, Great ski cool. resorts. Yeah. 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 No wonder you're fit. Ram? Yeah. Do you really like hiking or are you just doing it for me? No, I'm really liking it. <laughs> it's hard, but it's worth it. Yeah. We're almost at the junction for the low route versus high route. And it's a boggy day. Yeah. He's standing and then you're just sinking. You have to step really fast do, 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 before you sink. So this cairn here, everyone, is the junction. And that is the, I, I believe that's the valley route right there. This one is the craggy route, high route. So let's take this one. Almost missed it again. It's one o'clock now. <laughs> We're in the valley route still. <laughs> I'm looking at the high route up there. I cannot believe I walk all that along the bridges. <laughs> if you guys want to see my previous Coast to Coast video, watch day two. You'll see me um, almost crying. <laughs> And then I was sick with the cold as well. Oh, it's horrible. Huh? <laughs> Hello. Gotcha. Uh oh. <laughs> <laughs> That is the Land Creek Hotel where I stayed before for two nights.
There's a neon sheep store I want to go to. I want to live here too, <laughs> but Bobo will eat all the dogs. <laughs> yeah, a lot of hotel and B and B everywhere. They're all booked. More dogs. Grassmere gingerbread. It's really nice. I don't think people expect it to be like this. You have to here. stand in line. Oh no. This is the cemetery where you're we staring. Mm. I went in there. And this is the church. We're here at the Grassmere Brewery and then there's a guy who put a stuffed animal just like me taking a picture of the stuffed animal with his fish and chips. It's so cute. I'm spying on him. I want this for my house. <laughs> a portrait of a sheep. I might have to order from Beck Steps Gallery. <laughs> at 4.35 we are arriving at YHA Grassmere. We have a private room. Yay! Yay! There's a tenting area over there. There's one tent. This is our bedroom in the youth hostel. <laughs> we have a lot of bunk beds just for ourselves. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Which bed should I use? <laughs> hmm, maybe this one. Whenever I go to England, I always see drying room or, um, or uh, as a part of a facility of the hostel or hotel. We have drying room. I don't know what they what they are. So this is a drying room. It's hot. There's a heater, a fan that keeps running. It's hot, and people can dry their boots after hiking and dry their clothes if they don't want to use. The dryer. Dryers here are very scarce. People don't use dryers, so they usually just hang their clothes in the drying room, I guess. <laughs> Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know, but I'm going to dry my tent here. <laughs> mm. 